And as the winter storm heads our way, American Airlines is issuing a travel alert for 86 airports in its path, and that includes Charlotte Douglas International Airport. That's where Queen City News reporter Daniel Pierce joins us live tonight. Daniel, oh, holiday travelers, they're already seeing these delays right now. Yeah, we saw some earlier delays here. I'm over at a checkpoint C where we are at the departure and arrivals board. Uh, we saw some delays earlier today. A lot of those have been changed to being on time. Now, a couple though I want to bring your attention to, like the flight in Austin, supposed to leave at 10:22. It is now uh, departing at 12:15, which is 15 minutes more uh, than it was about five minutes ago. Then all the way down here to Minneapolis, the flight was supposed to leave at 6:49. It is now uh, going to be uh, departing at 1.15 a.m. to get here. But those seven-hour delays aren't just for departures. We're also seeing some of those for arrivals as well. It's the not-so-holly-jolly Christmas rush for airline travelers. A lot of them are trying to get out of Charlotte before they find themselves stuck and at the mercy of Old Man Winter. It's a relief now that I, that I know. <laughs> Deborah Murray is traveling to Salt Lake City and is among those whose flight was delayed before she even checked into the Charlotte Douglas International Airport. I just sent us a text saying instead of 6.45, you get 7.55 now. I'm, I'm leaving tonight. So, like, in, in the next hour, we'll be flying. Not yet. We haven't checked it yet. But I think everything's on point right now. Once we get over there, we're going to see, bro. Yeah. We're going to see, and I'm going to, I don't know, make my way it out. American Airlines travel alert impacts every airport in North Carolina. A company spokesperson says they're monitoring the winter storm and the impacts it will have on flights over the next three days. There's a lot of Dallas to Charlotte flights, so we're hoping that our plane stays in the south and it warms up by Saturday so we can get back for Christmas. We're not going to change our plans, so if we get stuck here, we at least have family here. I'm very relieved. I clearly picked the right day to get here. <laughs> Kitty Hazlitt was arriving home when we spoke with her. She was asked by American Airlines to switch her flight moments before she boarded, which meant she would have had to spend Christmas alone. They offered like up to four fifty, five hundred dollars to go on to because it was an overbooked flight and they were trying to get people to change the flights and but there wasn't any availability. She said no flights until the twenty fifth. And I was like, well that's crazy. Airline workers tell me that today was relatively calm than what they expected. However, tomorrow they expect that rush to really pick up. Their best advice is that if you are flying out of here tomorrow or even on Friday is to get here early, monitor the weather here in Charlotte and your destination. And lastly, and most crucially, be prepared to be flexible. Live at the Charlotte, Charlotte Douglas International Airport, Daniel Pierce, Queen City News. I'll be flexible in the holidays. Kind of a tough deal. All right.